Hi friends, welcome to my channel Star Reading Friend. Today I'm going to talk about this cryptocurrency that is a Swiss Fork uh, coin or CHSB coin. And I'll be talking about the latest entry price, exit price, and stop loss for short term and long term trades. So watch the video completely. And by end of the video, I'll explain how you can take simple trades and stay profitable. So I'm in the monthly chart. So let me draw the trend line. So this is the resistance trend line. And this is a support trend line. Within this range, only the candles are moving. And uh, you can see after this big fall, the candles have come down to the support. And now the candles are moving in this uh, channel support uh, level only. So if you go to the weekly chart, you can see after this uh, big fall, uh, the candles are at the uh, support level and moving in the sideways uh, pattern. So we need to, uh, you can see that here very well within this channel pattern only, the candles are moving in a sideways pattern. After this fall, the candles are continuously moving towards this resistance level. So already it is at the resistance uh, uh, trend line. So anytime it is going to fall. So once it falls to the support level, you can enter again. Okay, so the entry price after the fall and after the breakout, the entry price. So let me go to the day chart and give you that information. So, so you can see that here, uh, almost uh, the candles are at the resistance. So uh, it is very risky to enter here because uh, already it is in the resistance. And there is no point to uh, stay or enter in the trade because it's a very strong resistance. It may uh, push the price to come down. So after the fall, you can enter in the trade. So the entry price will be around 1590. Stop loss is uh, 1484. And the target will be, uh, the first target you can have it around uh, 1898. And the final target will be around 2083. Okay. So previously also it has taken this uh, target first target. And next target is this one. So you can go with that. So first target is this th this one. This is the uh, in initial target, and this is the uh, next target. Okay. So uh, this is the thing, and if you see the RSI, RSI is also indicating that it will go up, and after touching this, anything will happen. Either either it will give a breakout or it may fall to the support, and then after it will give a breakout. So you need to wait for that thing to happen. So this is all about the technical analysis. Now we'll talk about other important updates. Like the rank is around 142, around 69k people have kept this coin in the watch list. Current price is 203 and it is up by 5%. Uh, market cap is 203 million dollars, it is up by 4%. Volume traded in 24 hours is uh, 535 million, sorry, 535k uh, traded in this uh, 24 hours and it is up by 7, 84 uh, percentage. Around 1 billion CHSB coin is there in the circulating supply now we'll see some more updates and uh, you can see the holder count uh, and it is keep on increasing which is really a good thing and within seven days it has gained a lot of uh, holder counts 18,000 to now it is 8,837 and uh, now we'll see some uh, social media account uh, updates so there is an update here and uh, this is published by Swiss Borg this is the official Twitter uh, handle for this cryptocurrency they mentioned like Swiss Borg Academy is open our first step towards becoming one of the best in crypto education. Uh, start by browsing the library and give us your feedback. Read more, you can check out this academy.swissboard.com and learn academy. So this is a link and follow the Swissboard Academy here. Uh, Borg Academy. So this is the uh, latest update. You can see the image, start your crypto journey here. Uh, so this is the academy and uh, you can learn more about uh, cryptocurrency. So this is the update here, uh, came out recently. So now we'll just go back to the chart again and I'll explain how you can take simple trades and uh, stay profitable. So you can see if you go to the weekly chart, always start with the weekly chart. And uh, you can see after this big fall, you can see there's a breakout happen. And when you draw a trend line, that is a support uh, trend line. So this is a support trend line. And if you go to the day chart, after the breakout, you can see candles started moving up. So you can, uh, if you go to the day chart, you can see when the candles given a breakout, you should enter after the breakout that is around 1625 and uh, catch the momentum of this candle okay when these candles are going up so wait until uh, it is uh, uh, taking this resistance level so if you if you draw a trend line uh, for this uh, for this uh, uh, candles you can see after this uh, breakout it went up to the resistance uh, trend line so how you can uh, predict this uh, resistance because you can see previously uh, this was the support and now after the breakout it uh, will this level will act like a resistance so you can see this is the this is the support uh, trend line 
and uh, after the breakout this will act to the resistance so when the breakout happened here it went up to this level that means uh, it is uh, taking this resistance and the prices are uh, will push the price to come down so until here you can trade okay after the fall you can see you can enter again to uh, you can see after the fall again there is a breakout happen and then you can enter or you can just leave it once you get this uh, profit you can leave it and allow the candles to move up so that is not a problem because it is a strong resistance and after the fall you can see then again the fall happened after the breakout you could have entered here around this level around uh, 1704 and hold the trade until it is not going to the next uh, target that is this is the resistance level and this is also the uh, primary uh, resistance level so you can see when it went to this level you could exit the trade so you could have traded this also and traded this also and you can trade this also so that way you can make three trades okay so this is the momentum candles these are the momentum candles these are the momentum candles if you've traded all these three you could have made easy profit always have a stop loss in case if it's not uh, uh, going as per your plan you should exit right immediately five percent uh, loss is very uh, okay no don't lose more than that you need to safeguard your invested amount okay that is very important this is the only principle everybody follows and you can follow that so that's all for now i hope you learned something important please like share subscribe my channel thank you for watching have a nice day